Hi, my name is Christine Adam and I'm a voice, accent, and communication coach. And today I'm here to talk to you about how to feel ready and connected to your audience from the moment you begin to speak when you're in any kind of a public speaking scenario, whether that's as yourself or as a character. So the reason I wanna talk about this is because often the feedback that I get from clients is that they felt just fine a couple minutes in to a talk, but the beginning was really difficult and that was the part that they felt like they had a really hard time breathing, a really hard time connecting with the audience, even sometimes a hard time speaking clearly. And there's a reason for that. The reason for that is because often, because of nerves or for whatever reason, people tend to launch into that initial moment of talking before they were actually ready to speak. So the advice that I wanna give around how to make sure that you're ready is to actually give yourself a moment. So if you're live in person in a room, take a moment in your chair or standing in front of your audience to just land, feel your feet or feel your sit bones supporting you, see who it is that you're talking to, let the breath drop in and then begin. Same thing if it's virtual, right? Take a moment to feel the chair beneath you, to see the people on your computer screen, let a breath drop in and then begin. It really doesn't have to be that long. I'm just taking that beat to see who you're talking to just lets you feel a little bit more oriented into the here and now so that as you begin to speak, the body and the voice are more ready. They're more ready, they're here, you've been oxygenated, so you're gonna be thinking better. The breath is the power source for the voice, so you're gonna be speaking more clearly and with more ease. It just makes sure that, you know, it's very different than, for example, I'm looking at my notes and I suddenly just start speaking. Hello, everybody, okay, welcome, thank you very much. Right, you can see how I wasn't quite with you when I started to do that because I, I went from starting here to suddenly looking up and I couldn't quite see the camera. I had already started talking and then I'm setting myself up for a relationship of disconnection. I'm not connecting with my audience and I know I'm not connecting with my audience. That doesn't feel comfortable. So then the first couple minutes don't feel so comfortable until I've seen the audience for a little bit and then my body starts to get more comfortable. We're trying to get rid of all of that and instead just give ourselves a moment from the get-go. A lot of people feel at first uncomfortable doing that because it feels like you're taking up too much of the audience's time because it feels like a long moment. It's really not. It's not a long moment. It's not taking up too much of the audience's time. In fact, your audience will be happy that you did this because in the same way that you giving yourself a moment helps you connect to your audience, them seeing you give yourself a moment helps them connect to you. So it's a win-win. Don't just take my word for it. Give it a try. Let me know how it goes. If you found this video useful, please share it with anybody you think might find it useful too. Subscribe to my YouTube channel. Thank you so much and I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.